lives outside naked, eating a popsicle, like she does. Drunk. I've never seen you clearer than that. Floating somewhere up in the clutch. Going out of ourselves, can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real, cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning. So take me on a trip, 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 nah, trip, trip, trip. Oh, I flick that switch, kill the lights. Oh, I wasted. City lights are shining so bright. What's up, guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to do a real day in the life nighttime routine. I thought it would be really fun because I feel like I keep making excuses as to why I don't want to do this video. My house isn't clean. My kid won't put clothes on. The weather's not right. We have natural disasters all over the place. It is a beautiful day. We went out of the house. We adventured out of the house today, did a little wine tasting, went to a little farm stand, had a really great day. And the house is messy. I worked two weddings yesterday and I just was like, you know what? We're planning on doing a fire tonight and I thought it'd be really fun to just show you a fun day in the life at my house. It's normal life. We clean, we cook. So we're gonna make some leftovers for dinner tonight. And I thought it would be really fun to show you how I set myself up for success the night before. So tomorrow's Monday. So I'm gonna set myself up for tomorrow, tonight, cause that's how I start my morning routine is my morning routine starts with my nighttime routine. So I thought it'd be fun for you to just come along my night with me. We're gonna clean up the house right now and get ready for dinner. But I'm actually getting ready to make a green smoothie right now because I'm starving and it's never good to make dinner and clean when you're hungry, or at least not for me. So I'm gonna be making my green smoothie. I can put my recipe down below or maybe I'll list it right here, but I already added all of my liquids and my spinach and the fruit that I'm gonna use. I use the Tropica vanilla powder. I'm going to be using the Tropica Superfood Greens. I absolutely love this. This is my favorite greens powder. Are you sharing your popsicle with Phoebe? Liv is sharing her popsicle with Phoebe. How cute. You guys are the cutest. I love you. Anyway, I'm just adding my superfood greens into my smoothie right now, and then we're gonna blend this up and get cleaning. Ooh, make that mess. Exactly what I needed. All right, let's clean this out. How sweet are these flowers that Doug got me? efficiently for me anyway. So now I'm going to throw some dinner together. Like I said, we're just doing leftovers. So I'll show you my plate when I'm done with it, but I don't wanna keep time-lapsing you because how boring is that? We did tri-tip last night, so we're gonna make tri-tip tacos. So I'm gonna grill up some veggies. I'm currently eating a low FODMAP diet. So no garlic, no onions, like not a lot of stuff. So I'm keeping my tacos pretty basic to just meat and grilled veggies. So an avocado because I can have a little bit of avocado. Okay, so I will show you dinner when it's all ready and then we'll do a fire together and it'll be fun. 
All right, so this is our tacos three different ways. As you can see, Liv eats the same food as we do. Doug adds guacamole and some salsa to his. As for me, I kept mine really simple with just grilled veggies and avocado. <gasps> You want apple juice? My apple juice. A really big part of our nighttime routine is spending time together as a family. We've always spent a lot of time outside, but with everything that's been going on in 2020, we have been spending a lot of time in our backyard. We have been absolutely loving having dinners outside on the lounge watching the sun go down. Liv's new favorite thing is watching the stars come out. She can actually point to Jupiter, Saturn, and Mars. It's been really fun. We just absolutely love it. I just want to let you know I could go for this no more tricks. Despite our hot weather during the days here in Sonoma County, it always cools down at night, which is something that I absolutely love about Sonoma County. But because it gets cool, it is so much fun to just light a fire, enjoy some wine, have some dinner, and just spend time together as a family. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. So give me a sign. Give me a sign. Baby, just give me a sign. Baby, give me a sign. Just give me one more talking to you and here we go again. Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me. Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in. So give me a sign. We always have music going at our house, so after dinner, it's always dance party time with this kiddo. Liv has been in love with Moana lately, so we've been working on our hula. After our dance party, we start to get Liv ready for her nighttime routine. We've been doing books on the lounge lately because it's been so nice outside and we've been really enjoying it. So we read books every night and then we finish Liv's nighttime routine in her room. Once Liv goes down, I always set myself up for success the night before, so I get my coffee started and I make sure that the kitchen is clean. Next up, I get my nighttime skincare routine going. If you guys would like to watch an in-depth nighttime skincare routine, I will have one listed above. I just did one a couple weeks ago, so you guys can go check that out. I'm still using all of the same products that I had been using. I'm still loving my Naturium. Absolutely loving my nighttime skincare routine, you guys. Go check it out if you're interested in that. Cause now I dream about you. I was probably too drunk. It's blurry, but I've got the image of you. Oh hey girl. Bonus to you if you knew I wore glasses. Alright. So another big thing that I always do the night before is I set my workout clothes out ahead of time. So I always have my tennis shoes, my workout gear, my headphones, everything I'm gonna need for the next day. A big part of our nighttime routine is just spending time together, just the two of us. So sometimes we'll just sit outside on the lounge and enjoy a glass of wine and catch up on our day. But I always do my gratitude journaling at night and I always write down a list of five things that I want to have accomplished the next morning. I do get up early, so it's important for me to have a very specific list of five tasks that I can get done the next day. That way I stay on track. It's so easy to get derailed in the mornings, especially if Liv wakes up early. So just having a quick list of things that I can get done, finishing with gratitude. Sometimes I'll do some yoga, foam rolling, or meditation. But for tonight, I'm just going to do my gratitude journaling, write my list of things to do, and then I'm going to do some reading and snuggling with my husband. Die, die, die. 
And that's it for today's video, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. And please subscribe because it really supports my channel. And don't forget to hit that notification bell because it'll let you know when my next video comes out. And thanks so much for watching, you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Dive into you. It doesn't even matter.